I'm Sam Vaknin, and I'm the author of Malignant Self-Love, Narcissism Revisited. It is common knowledge that brain disorders, injuries and traumas are sometimes misdiagnosed as mental health conditions. But what about run-of-the-mill organic medical conditions? Syphilis provides a fascinating example. Syphilis is a venereal, sexually transmitted disease. It has a few stages and involves unpleasant phenomena such as lesions and skin eruptions. Syphilis can go dormant, latent, for years or even decades before it affects the brain in a condition known as general paresis. Brain tissue is gradually destroyed by the tiny organisms that cause syphilis, the spiro spirochetes. This progressive devastation of the brain causes mania, dementia, megalomania, delusions of grandeur, and paranoia. Even when its existence is suspected, syphilis is difficult to diagnose. Most mental health clinicians are unlikely to try to rule it out at all. Syphilis, in its tertiary, brain-consuming phase, produces symptoms that are easily misdiagnosed as bi bipolar disorder combined with narcissistic and paranoid personality disorders. Syphilitic patients in the tertiary, brain-consuming stage are often described as brutal, suspicious, delusional, moody, irritable, raging, lacking empathy, grandiose, and demanding. And if this sounds familiar, that's also a very good description of narcissistic personality disorder. Syphilitic patients are indecisive and absorbed in irrelevant detail one moment and irresponsibly and maniacally impulsive the next. They exhibit disorganized thinking, transient false beliefs, mental rigidity, and obsessive-compulsive repetitive behaviors. Adolf Hitler was remote diagnosed by the famous psychoanalyst Eric Fromm as suffering from narcissistic personality disorder. Fritz Redlich, retired dean of the Yale Department of Psychiatry, published a book titled Hitler, Diagnosis of a Destructive Prophet in 1998. In this book, Redlich describes the final stages of general neurosyphilitic paresis. Quote, signs and symptoms include rapid mental deterioration, psychotic, and usually absurdly grandiose behavior, page, page 231. It is easy to confuse tertiary syphilitis, syphilis with uh, personality disorders, especially the narcissistic and paranoid ones.